Hey guys, it's Melissa and I'm here with a vlog today. I thought that Stephanie and I should start vlogging again daily and then try to put out a weekly vlog at the end of the week because I watch a lot of vlogs on YouTube, mostly Alex and Mia's daily vlogs every single day. Um, Stephanie got me into that so it's Sunday here and I'm going to see a movie later with Stephanie and one of our friends and right now I'm going to clean my room I'm actually in my room right now just in my bed but my room is a disaster toxic waste dump I've been putting off cleaning my room for probably honestly I don't know, a few months now. I start cleaning it and then I stop cleaning it and I never fully clean my room all the way through. So I'm going to work on that right now because I just can't live like this anymore. It's just so messy and generally I'm not really a messy person so I don't know why I let my room get this bad. Ooh, it just looks so bad. So I didn't make much progress on my room. I got sidetracked when One Direction made their appearance on the red carpet and I had to go watch that because I heard Stephanie screaming so obviously I knew it was One Direction and then I watched Taylor Swift's Bad Blood music video which honestly they've been hyping it so much and I thought it was going to be a lot better considering they have all of these big celebrities in it so... I don't know, I thought it was going to be at least 10 minutes long or, you know, an actual motion picture kind of thing, but it was 3 minutes and 50 seconds and I don't know, I just wasn't that impressed. But I am ready to go. Um, I took a shower. I'm going to put my hair up in like a little bun type of thing. And I think I'm going to change my shirt because this black and white is just this really... Mm, really really contrast it's like looks super bright and I'm looking at myself in the mirror over here too and it's just not looking the way I envision this outfit to look so I know I'm just going to the movies but this shirt just doesn't look right so I'm gonna change really quickly so this is the movie we're going to see Iris um, it's about Iris Athel and I got this actually last time when we went to the movie theater and we went to go see Dior and I and they just had these little Flyers. So I picked this one up. I thought the colors were really pretty. And now Stephanie's favorite song is playing on the radio. Is this, this your favorite? The weekend. Yeah. So do you like this one? Honestly, I don't really care. It's you just like this song so I just much. I like the song so much. You play it every single day. Yeah, it's the first song that I play when I start the song doing anything. I, yeah, pretty much. Hey. You love the song this so much. Uh, the sun is so bright. I know, the sun is so bright like, right now. Right now, right now, right now, right now. My eyes are like literally starting to water because I don't want to like... <laughs> here and who, who forgot their cop at home who forgot their movie cop this one this one forgot her cup look really short well I'm wearing taller She's wearing shoes. her kitten heels <sighs> so Stephanie forgot her cup and we're here even though we live like five minutes from here I got here really fast we're not going back home we're not going back home I'm just gonna get like a water cup I was gonna get sprite I thought it would go with clear soda so water it is Outfit of the day, go. I'm wearing this thrifted suede crocheted jacket from the Goodwill Clearance Center. The Zara oversized turtleneck. My BDG high rise jeans that I cut the whole knees out of. There's like hair in it, so that's gross. Um, Zara boots, favorite, they're Melissa's. Uh, really, really old vintage, not vintage, not vintage, what am I saying? A uh, fringe bag from H&M and then this turquoise choker thing I got at the flea market. It comes with a cuff too, so. Outfit of the day, go. Outfit of the day, I'm wearing these H&M overalls. 
that you guys have seen in a video before. This gray shirt that's just from Forever 21. It's not, I changed shirts because I didn't like the other one. Plus I was getting hot. Uh, my glasses, makeup free today. So pretty. Because uh, I'm letting this thing under my nose heal. I had like a... You can't even see it. I had something under my nose going on. My Forever 21 backpack. It looks like cement gray on camera, but and it's... And then like... my favorite shoes that Stephanie hates when I wear them. My Zara kitten heels, as she calls them. I don't think they're technically called kitten heels. They're I not, they're but still. They're technically called, but they're my favorite. So we just got out of the movie and, well actually documentary, but movie, and it was so good. It made me feel really lazy because Iris Athel is 93 years old and she's doing all of this and I can barely get up early in the morning. I can barely make it to the gym. So right now we are at the mall and we are going to Kona Grill to get some food. Here's Stephanie and Fernando just walking over there. So we ended up coming to the store because I didn't want to go buy a different McDonald's and I was like, let's just go to the store and see if I can get something there. And now we're buying a bunch of other stuff like Ezekiel bread and avocados and I feel like I want a bag of chips but I shouldn't get chippies. I know I'm better than that guys. I'm trying to stop eating chippies. Like I'm trying to stop drinking grizzlies but but then I always end up getting a bag of chips somewhere and I, I don't eat them all in one sitting or anything like that but I just don't want to eat chips but then I end up craving chips. So I don't know. Sometimes I feel like I have so many options at the store. So I can't figure out what I want. What kind of bread do you want? I wanted, I don't know, I don't really like sesame. Um, I don't really like seven grains. They have cinnamon raisin, but that's not really go, gonna go with what I want. No, so, let's see. Let's see. The low sodium one. That sounds boring. Yeah, it does. So, I don't know, we might go look at the other breads and see what yeah, they have. Yeah, we don't have to get that. Yeah. We don't have to, but... I told Stephanie to pick whatever bread she wanted because honestly, I will eat any kind of bread. I love bread. Not really sweet breads, honestly, but I have... I'll eat, I'll eat bread. I love bread. Nuts and seeds or flax and sunflower? Um, flax and sunflower. She's a mad woman. What are you doing? Trying to pick a good watermelon. I got a watermelon the other day and it turned out horrible and I was extremely disappointed in myself for picking such a bad watermelon. Ugh. Let's go. I used to work at uh, Sprouts now, or Sunflower, formerly Sprouts, and we had um, bulk and I would just eat all the stuff out of the bulk all the time. Wait, you're saying you worked at a supermarket? Yes, I worked at a supermarket for like over two years and I pushed carts, guys. I started from the bottom. And when I left, I was still at the bottom. <laughs> so we just got home. I didn't end up getting chips. I am very proud of myself. And I'm going to change out of my overalls. Um, definitely take a Benadryl right now because my nose is driving me crazy. My nose is just insane. It's off the charts right now. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, it's Monday here in Casa Valenzuela and it's about 11.20 right now. Punk and I are just watching Kathy Lee and Hoda. Didn't get a really great night's sleep last night. I slept funny on my arm and my nose was bothering me and it, honestly it's still bothering me right now. Sorry, I have like something in my eye. But I'm just making Stephanie some breakfast right now. She's been really wanting to try, I don't know, bread with avocado with egg on it. Nothing too crazy, nothing really new. But I was like, oh, I'll make it for you because I kind of enjoy cooking and I... I'm kind of the house chef, so I'm just gonna whip that up right now. So here's the breakfast I made for Punk, just a piece of toast. She wanted some garlic on it, so I put that in and I put that on the bread. Some avocado and then her egg with the 
yolk actually pretty hard. So she doesn't like runny yolks. She really doesn't like yolk unless it's scrambled. So I'm going to serve this up right now. Yay, it's finally here. So Punk and I worked on a little project with Urban Outfitters and their blog. And it's finally up today. So all the stuff that we worked on a while back is like finally up. Yay, I'm excited. And you guys will probably see the video and probably read this blog post. Blog post before this vlog is up, but... Here it is, are you excited? So it is the early afternoon now and I got ready, did my makeup. I'm ready to film uh, my lookbook today that I actually wanted to film last week but I had to put it off because it rained one day, one day for a very brief period of time but then the two days before the rain it was very, very cloudy way too overcast to film outside. It's dark outside. I just want to go take the recycling out because it always comes on Tuesdays. I also had to come and grab something from the car. I completely forgot the camera when we went to go film, but we didn't film as much as I would have wanted to. It was windy again today, which is really annoying because now that I have this payload here, it blows in my face and <sighs> It's very annoying, which I don't like. It makes me want to cut my hair off, but I'm not going to do that. Um, but I did go by the store and got some potatoes because I wanted to make some uh, purse tree. Uh, potatoes, I watch Amy vagabond you with her Snapchats all the time and she always is making like really good food. She looks like she can cook really well. Um, and I kind of consider myself a chef, like I said earlier. So I wanted to get potatoes to make some, like I saw her making one of her snaps on her Snapchat. So went to get potatoes and then I caved and got chippies. So going to make that now. And I think the Bruce Jenner special is also recorded, which we want to watch the second part of it. Punk actually, I went to go grab something from the car and she locked me out and I was like, I can't get in. But then she's like, you have the keys. Silly me, silly rabbit, tricks are for kids. Jane, what are you doing? Hey guys, it's Tuesday afternoon. I'm in the car, I'm on my way to go to Dunkin'. I had a craving for iced coffee and I asked Punk if she wanted one and of course she wasn't going to say no. So I'm gonna go there right now, then come home, get ready, hopefully go finish filming these looks that are right here. We got the goods right here. They look basically the same but I tried French vanilla today and then I just got Stephanie her usual hazelnut iced coffee unsweetened with cream and sugar and I just tried the uh, French vanilla sweetened sweetened I guess French vanilla with uh, cream and sugar I was about to say with hazelnut with cream and sugar unsweetened I usually get the hazelnut iced coffee uh, sweetened <laughs> I had one job guys and that was to just bring the iced coffees in and I thought that I brought them in the right way. I did. I brought them in exactly like the lady gave them to me and the one that I thought was mine, the French vanilla, was actually the hazelnut and I put a bunch of sugar in it thinking that it was mine and then tried it I'm like oh no she messed up but it was actually Stephanie's drink and then mine is super sweet the French vanilla Jane seriously it is about 3 30 now um I am going to go and get gas for the car so, uh, yeah, what else? We are gonna finish filming a video we started filming yesterday. Melissa's uh, video that's gonna be up later this week. And then we're gonna go to the gym later today. What else? I don't know. I need to go get cash out because the gas station that I go to, um, 
it's like cheaper if you use cash so I'm gonna do that I really don't want to get soda but I'm not going to I'm not gonna get soda so we just got in the car right now and Stephanie found this old mixtape I guess that she made and we're listening to it and it's the weirdest compilation of song <laughs> but one of the songs that we're listening to right now is by a band called the fall of troy the now defunct band the fall of troy but honestly this album it's called doppelganger one of my favorite albums here you have to listen to it oh wait no this is just like the guitar solo but such a good album i remember our mom took us to see them play a show at this place called The Clubhouse in Tempe, which later got shut down, I think, because somebody got stabbed to death there. Oh, here it is. Here's the good part. So it is now 5.50-ish. Uh, this one right here my child, my daughter, um, she left her shoes or a pair of her shoes at the house. So we have to go and grab them and then come back and film one last outfit. But luckily we live pretty close to where we usually film. So it's not that big of a deal. Now just bump into some old school Brittany. Thanks motorcycle. Um, yeah, that's basically it. So it's Wednesday here in Casa Valenzuela. It's around 10.30ish, a little bit later than that. Um, we were supposed to go and, I don't know, meet with some people from Urban Outfitters to work on some stuff today. And it was supposed to be at 10.30 and then it was supposed to be at 11 and now it's being pushed back to 11.15. So thankfully we didn't leave our house all the way yet. We literally we drove just drove around the block and came back home. But we're, you know, we are ready. I can We've, like take a power like nap. Yeah, power nap. Like We've been up since minutes. like 7.45, so. Mm -hmm. That's really early, you guys yeah, know that. That's pretty early for us. So we're just gonna go back inside now and just chill. Swag money. So guys, we just left our late brunch. Wow, it's already 1.14. Oh, there's a uniform shop there. That's kind of cool. It's like scrubs. Oh, I thought it was like school uniforms. Anyways, we're headed now. We're now headed over to the Hole in the Rock to shoot some photos and then the Desert Botanical Garden. So hopefully I will get some footage there. I didn't want to vlog during our little lunch because it's the first time I'm really meeting both Sarah of and Sarah. Sarah and Sarah, both of these very nice ladies so I didn't want to be like in their face with a camera and be like I'm vlogging because sometimes people are uncomfortable with yeah. when you have your camera so I don't want to be like hey I'm actually vlogging and you're gonna like I want to show everybody like what I'm doing but I mean, I hopefully I'm not invading your privacy so I didn't want to be like in their face with a camera and the food was so good, good. We, we watch Alex and Mia's vlogs. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned that a few times. I think I've mentioned it like 20 times. But anyways, we watch their vlogs and so now we always find ourselves saying so good because honestly, it's so catchy. Here we are, the hole in the rock. That's it right there. There's a hole in that rock. Twenty, and we got back around 7 yeah. so we were home for a bit really tired after being out the whole day um, and then I'm with my pillow one of my pillow pets right here and um, then after we were so hungry so we decided to go get Hawaiian BB HBBQ Hawaiian BBQ and I actually got a full size meal right. instead of a mini meal which is what I usually get so we are going to show us your food this is the best bam 
It look, probably looks just, the lighting doesn't, does no justice. Barbecue, beef, vegetables, rice, rice, more vegetables. I don't like the macaroni salad. I love the macaroni salad. So we're basically going to just watch a bit of TV, eat our food, and then turn down for, for what tonight? What? We are so tired today. We've been up since like 7.45. About crack of dawn. What's up, guys? It is Thursday, May 21st, 11 a.m., I woke up a while ago, but I've just been like catching up on stuff and I'm headed to Macca's right now to get a drizzy. Um, today is the event, our pop-up shop at Urban Outfitters, which is pretty exciting. So it is, as you can tell, 1.13. I finally figured out how to put one of these on the computer. It's something you actually have to download, like an app for your computer. So I downloaded it and now I have it, so I'm cool like everybody else. Um, Melissa is over there on the couch, chillaxing. I painted my nails blue and they don't match my toenails, which is kind of, I don't know. I usually like to have my toenails and my nails match. So if I want to wear sandals, so I obviously won't be wearing sandals today because my toenails are gray. So I thought the blue was kind of like a nice pop of color. I'm not sure what I'm wearing to the event tonight just yet if i'm going to wear a dress that i already have or if i'm gonna find something at urban outfitters it is now 3 10 in the afternoon it's like not gonna focus is it there we go 3 10 in the afternoon i am almost ready for the urban outfitter event urban outfitters event um i have my face and makeup on <gasps> And all I have to do is my eyeliner and then do my hair. It's just in this little clippy thing right now because Melissa has not so subtly been hinting that she is thirsty and wants a drink and needs some caffeine. And I asked her when I left for McDonald's earlier this morning, hey, do you want something from McDonald's? You know, I can put it in the refrigerator. She was sleeping somewhat half asleep. And she's like, no, I don't want anything. And then right when she wakes up, she starts saying she's thirsty and she wants a drink. So I'm going back to McDonald's, but I decided I would just stop by Dunkin' to get myself an iced coffee. I'm really, really anxious and nervous. My palms are sweating. Like, I'm trying to tell myself I'm not nervous, but my body is showing me, giving me the signs that I'm a little nervous right now. Um for the event and whatever. We have to be there at 4.30, so I told Melissa, you need to get ready. It's just literally right down the street from us, so it's not gonna, it's gonna take us like five minutes to get there, but still, I don't like being late, you guys know that, so I'm gonna go by Dunkin' and then McDonald's and then come back and finish getting ready. We are now on our way to the Urban Outfitters. We're running a bit late. Um, but it's not even 6 yet. We were supposed to be there at 4.30, so I don't, I guess just to be there early, um, and I don't really know, get pictures or something. I'm not sure what we're doing. Maybe pick out an outfit, but we brought our dresses, so we were trying to coordinate, but we also didn't want to wear dresses that we've already worn, and we've worn almost all of the dresses. Look guys, it says you owe road trip. That's today's day and it has our names. Can I reach it? Stephanie, Melissa, and Shop. How cute is that? So it is, um, I'm not really sure what time it is, I don't have my phone on me, but we are at the event. It's happening. We met two lovely, lovely uh, viewers. So it was nice meeting you guys. There's nobody else here, so I'm happy my fingers crossed that more people are gonna show up maybe like later I don't know hopefully because I don't want this to be all for nothing it's so pretty I'm gonna show you guys around a little bit so there's just dresses everywhere obviously um, there's some accessories and then more dresses this is um, something that they built for the event it's awesome it has all of these real live flowers. Um, so yeah, it's super cool. So guys, we are at the Urban Outfitters event and we met some lovely viewers. So we're gonna introduce you guys to them. 
Here is obviously Melissa. Oh, okay. Say hi, say hi. your name. Hi. I'm Connie. I'm Claudia. We love Connie, you guys. Claudia. So, yeah, we're having a great time. So it is 10.46 now, Thursday, after the event. We've been home for, I don't know, we got home like at nine, I wanna say. Mm -hmm. Maybe, maybe sometime, maybe a little bit before then, but we had a really good time. Mm -hmm. And so we relaxed for a little bit, car. And now we're gonna go get some food, just like from the drive-thru. Oh, they live there. Oh. Mm. I'm just gonna nosy go get neighbor nosy right here, neighbor right so here. I always wanna know what's going on. So we're gonna probably get some food now. Hey guys, it's Stephanie and it's Friday evening right now. Um, we didn't vlog anything today just because Melissa worked and I planned on cleaning the house and cleaning the backyard and just doing a little bit of everything. And then there was um, kind of like just a freak accident when I was out back today. And everybody's okay, everything's fine, everything will be fixed by next week. Um, but I just had to end up spending the whole day cleaning that up and just figuring stuff out to fix it. So like I said, I'm fine, everything will be fine. Um, but there was just really no time for vlogging and I was on the phone all day basically <laughs> trying to figure things out. So I think I'm going to end our weekly vlogs here just because this weekend is going to be super boring even though it's Memorial Day weekend. Probably going to spend it at home for the most part. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this weekly, it's a week, yeah, weekly vlog. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you have any suggestions or you feel like we should omit or add anything please let me know in the comments down below and i will see you guys next week for a new vlog